Welcome to the product demonstration of the award-winning Hippotizer Chipmunk Media Server. I'm Sarah Cox, Technical Sales Manager and Hippotizer Trainer for Green Hippo, and I'll be running through what makes Chipmunk the projection product of the year. So to take a quick look at the hardware, from the front, we've got the power on button and two USB ports for uploading media. On the rear of the Chipmunk product, we have an IEC input, we have a DVI for your Zookeeper monitor, we have two USB 3 ports. This is for fast media upload. We have a network port for connecting multiple hypotizers together. And then finally, there is the single HD output via DVI or HDMI. Now to have a look at the Chipmunk software. New for Green Hippo, we have a launch application directly from starting up the Chipmunk media server. On powering up, you'll be taken to this desktop, which will be able to launch the Hippotizer engine and the Zookeeper software. Also, there is a link to the tutorials that are stored on the media server, which will help you get up and running with some basic tutorials. Also, the manual is launchable directly from this screen. So to take a closer look at the Hippotizer interface for the Chipmunk, we have two full HD video layers available. It's the same user interface as for our, the rest of our Hippotizer range. And what we have available this time is two further license upgrade paths. More on that in a minute. We have the full Zookeeper components to add and remove functionality from the Hippotizer system. We, it's fully compatible with the industry standard external controls such as DMX, MIDI, TCPIP, um, OSC, RS-232 and MANET. Um, we have full industry integration with the standard visualization tools such as CITP, using that to talk back to pre-visualization software such as WYSIWYG and Polar Capture, to name but a few. We also include the Hippotizer mapping tools such as Video Mapper, Pixel Mapper for DMX and Artnet and Kynet, and the Region Mapping tool for drawing 2D onto 3D surfaces. So a quick look at the interface for the Chipmunk Media Server. We have the two full HD layers available, including the level and mixer modes to mix video between the layers. We have a full scaling section where we can look at the aspect ratio and the zoom of the layer and the overall position on its output. There is full keystone available on the layer, including a full color section which has brightness, contrast, shift, saturation, and a full color picker to match your video content to say you're moving light rig. On each layer of the Hippotizer, there is also two full effects engines containing 100 plus effects in each engine. So on the Chipmunk, that's four effects engines plus a further two on the master layer. We also have functionality on the master output such as screen warping, where you can warp your output on a non-linear surface. Built directly into the interface is the use of presets in our preset manager. Here we can record looks and certain information such as color or scaling information, and this can be recalled during a show or used as a base point to start creating timelines from. Here I put my scaling in the top corner and I can record that geometry position to recall back in my programming. This combined with the single layer in the crossfade engine means that we have full transitions such as fade. There's also transition time available to us. Combined with presets that we've made allows for a very powerful show control solution that's easy to use and comes straight from the media server product. Now we'd like to give you a very short demonstration of the region mapper component. This component is available in the chipmunk base model. With this component, we can map 2D content onto 3D objects such as cubes or scenic elements. On the destination, using the click and point tool, we can draw around our cube or our surface area very quickly and map content onto that surface. Using the source side of the GUI, 
we can then select which part of the source content to send to that surface. We at Green Hippo are offering something very different with the Chipmunk product. The Chipmunk is available in three variations. Chipmunk Base, this is the hardware including entry level Zookeeper software functionality. Then there are two further upgrade paths available through two licensing options. These can be added to your Chipmunk at any time. The Control Upgrade unlocks your Hippotizer for external control such as DMX, MIDI or OSC. It also adds pixel mapping functionality via Kynet or Artnet. The Connector Control Upgrade focuses on unlocking functionality of HippoNet, Green Hippo's very own proprietary networking protocol. This will allow you to connect multiple chipmunks together to create much larger output projects. Licenses can be purchased directly through your local distributor. They can then be added to the chipmunk via the chipmunk launch screen directly. Details of each license can be found on the back of the technical data sheet available for download from the Green Hippo website. Thank you for watching. For more information, please visit www.hippotizer.com or email info at green-hippo.com. Thank you.